for both the surf and the winds, both categories in the weather threat index high. And those winds are especially strong over the Big Island right now, where there's not only a high wind warning for Big Island summits, but even at the surface, Hilo Town, Konaside, both are under a wind advisory through midnight tonight with 15 to 30 mile per hour northerly winds. High surf for the north and the west shores and another gorgeous day for the islands tomorrow. We might see some showers for windward spots and maybe even leeward spots in the early morning hours, but for the most part, no heavy rain and uh, drier conditions by the afternoon. So lots of sunshine for you to enjoy. Across the islands right now, 74 Hilo in the 60s for Molokai as well as Lanai City, 69 for Lihue and for Honolulu, 73. How about them northerly winds? Nice and cool overnight, uh, even though we didn't have any record lows, but we'll still see those northerly winds tonight. And I'll also push out any pockets of moisture away from the state, so we do not expect any rain. Now today, and this afternoon especially, it has been Pretty much bone dry for Oahu and Kauai. We did see a little bit of rain and just a little bit in upcountry Maui as well as the Hamakua coastline in areas such as Honoka'a. But other than that, it has not been a wet weather situation for the islands today as we begin to dry out. In surf, 14 to 20 for the north shores under a high surf advisory, 10 to 14 for the west side under a high, uh, uh, high surf advisory. And now that the sunshine is back, might want to go to the beach? Well, Box jellies are possible, not just tomorrow, but through Sunday. Check with lifeguards. They do the counts every morning. East side at 3 to 5, and a small craft advisory statewide due to those stronger winds. So northeast trades are back tomorrow at 10 to 25. We anticipate lots of sunshine and very little in the way of rain. And the drying out will continue in through the upcoming weekend. So now we look at how long the trades are going to be sticking around and when's our next weather maker. Trades are sticking around through Sunday. They turn southeasterly Monday and our next wet weather event possibly Tuesday through Thursday as another cold front approaches from the west. Joe, back to you.